Hi guys, um, I'm gonna show you uh, a quick uh, quick uh, review of uh, Nikon View NX software. Um, it will be like um, a, a first launch of it. I downloaded it from the web page. It's obviously free because <laughs> it uh, doesn't want uh, nothing from me. So uh, everyone. Uh, can download it even if it's not a Nikon consumer. Um, I download uh, a raw file of, uh, of a web page, the the preview, digital preview. Uh, it is of uh, some. Um, sorry, I'm recording a small screen. It is. Uh, uh, example scene. Uh, of the new Nikon um, 5200 uh, uh, so uh, there is a raw file uh, this is a T file but we don't need it the raw file uh, you can um, edit it uh, in uh, in edit mode there is a browser mode and edit mode and you can edit it in edit mode uh, the most important slider is the compensation slider. You can compensate it uh, plus two and minus two, which is uh, I think not enough, but uh, it's okay. Um, there is a uh, some sort of a some sort. Of, it doesn't give me to change the um, the color temperature of the file but we should have to live with that um, there is a, a, a the importance of sliders are more contrast and less contrast which it doesn't work very very good but uh, the less contrast it doesn't work very well uh, brightness we don't need that uh, high, high highlight pre, uh, protection uh, I have just this file for right now uh, if I do a highlight protection I'm not sure is it gonna be able to read more information from the raw file because this is a raw file uh, but um, the D, the D light and uh, shadow protection uh, shallow protect tune works uh, not bad uh, it uh, it pull ups uh, it pull out information from the real raw file uh, the cover booster I don't recommend it it's very not natural uh, doesn't matter do you use people or nature it's so it's not usable uh, the good uh, the, this uh, crop function this is something interesting you have uh, built-in uh, proportions uh, and um, this is this is good so you can always keep s proportions in your photography I have some sort of a excuse me You have some sort of uh, corrections. Uh, we can use them, of course. But um, overall, there aren't much things to do. Uh, some things are not usable, like we said, the uh, contrast, the brightness, um, the highlight protection. I'm not sure of it. I need to check it more, more later on. Uh, shadow and delight looks okay. Uh, cover browser is not usable so it's uh, for for a software uh, it's it's not the best but uh, half of the things uh, are useful as some half of the things are uh, can be used and it's for, for free piece of software it's, it's not bad you can do some things with it uh, 
yeah, of course uh, when you are down with editing you can um, uh, where was it convert files and convert it so uh, it uh, transfer your uh, raw file to a tiff or whatever other form file, for file format you choose for it so here it is now we have a, a tiff but uh, sorry about that I don't want this uh, problem when uh, when I open a tiff a lot of those functions are not available uh, contrast and brightness I don't need them uh, highlight priority I think w work the same way like in raw yeah the same way like in raw nothing special shallow protection and the lighting they work even in teeth they they're very well made obviously they work in a floating point information like the raw and also in uh, this um, RGB TIFF it also work, works so uh, it's, a, it's a pretty good uh, piece of software uh, I recommend using it and try to make uh, pic your pictures look better with it so thank you for watching